Now school winds down, that means sadly enough, so does guy time, but not before I caught up with a member of the NAU football team, Dijon Walker, a senior next year who missed all of last year due to injury. Dijon and I grabbed a football and played a little catch as we talked NAU football. Time, it's guy time. It's guy time. I'm here with Dijon Walker, a wideout for the NAU Lumberjacks. Now, D, you're coming off an injury. Can you tell me a little bit about that? The injury that I suffered two weeks before fall camp last year is a complex tear in my meniscus. It's not one that is likely to happen going into your senior year. You're in top condition. You don't really expect things to go that way. You hit a bump in the road, and I would just had to get through it. It was a challenging process, and overall it was a humbling experience. Was the hardest part about that injury, was it mental or physical? Honestly, it was both. It was a little bit both. Mentally, I had to get through that I would be able to play again. Sometimes you go through those situations and you don't really know if you would be able to play again. You don't know if you're going to be the same person that you once were, the same type of player. It kind of gives you that, you know, that unedged feeling that you don't really know what to expect. You don't know what's going to happen. Physically, it's just, it's, you're not the same person going, coming out of surgery. You have injuries, every athlete has injuries, but you know, you go through surgery and you don't really know if you're gonna get your explosiveness back. You don't know if you're gonna fluctuate in weight. And you just kinda have to have trust in the process. And I was blessed enough to have a wonderful support system, both you know, people that helped me train, my family and my friends, the coaches, they're all just all in it together. And that's what it's honestly all about. Now let's look ahead to the Lumberjacks this year. Got a lot of new people, new quarterback, a new offensive line coach. What can we expect out of the Jacks this year? You can expect great things from the Jacks this year. There we go, we heard it right here first. Yes sir, yes sir. <laughs> 2015 will be a, a, an amazing year for the Jacks. We have a new offensive coordinator. We have new coaches all around. We are bringing great players back, both in offense and on the defensive side of the board. And we're all in this together just to commit to excellence and to set the standard each and every day. We're working hard right now in the spring to, you know, just set that standard for NAU. And just we want to win a national championship and a Big Sky championship here. And that's what we're working for, and that's what we're going to commit to. Dijon, thank you for joining me. Hey, I appreciate me, it, and it's good playing catch with appreciate you. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Like I said, we got spring game this Saturday, and I hope weather permits. Last year, snow ruined it. They pushed it back. And I'm excited to see Dijon back on the field. It's been a while. I was watching your form out there. Are you going to be out there tossing the ball on yeah, Saturday? I might actually try out for football team next year. There you go. I well, might see. be the Come on. You're Dijon. graduating. You just told us that. I know, but. And I'm so, <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm pretty Connor. disappointed that there's no more guy times. Love it. I know. It's the last one, I but know. it was a good, good time it was with a good Dijon. Ending. Just put a little catch and everything to end the last <laughs> guy time. Come back and give us a guy time once in a while when Definitely. you're a big time star. Man. All right, I'll try. All right. And one more look at weather when we come back.